I'm busy developing some big projects at the moment and applying for funding for residency and for further creative development on them. I have been writing for a long time so they would involve the writing and research that I've done in the past and also a lot of it would be choreographic. I would want it to be filmed as well. I would like to create a documentary and film. These projects are of course um, covering social reform issues and one of them is more specifically regarding abuse and abuse survivors and uh, tools to help um, combat the side effects of abuse. I'm Sian Kent, I'm the writer of Another Paradise. Janet still the director of Another Paradise. It's about a shepherd who he meets um, in a barren part of Provence, busily planting a forest. One sure. man regenerates an entire region, mm -hmm. all on his That's own, right. yeah. over yeah. the course of 40 years. Yeah, yeah. but held by his dog. Yeah, well, of course. Yeah. A little bit, yeah. yeah. Someone every night may lose their phone and wallet forever. I give out free lollipops to certain people. I have no idea what the first trick I ever did would. It was probably something awful like this sort of thing, like, oh, hey, ah. See that? And that's a staple of my show now as well. If you're a fan of that and puns upon the fact my surname is Cox, then you're in for a treat. We do all the martial arts and kung fu. Fight sequences are great because they're actually, they are like a dance. Brace yourself. Ready? Yeah, punk. Five, six. This is the Sticky TV election special. This is the word on musicians. This is the word on hip hop dancing. I'm at the town hall to hang out with the New Zealand Symphony Orchestra. of a so-called anti-smacking bill. Now this sounds like it's going to affect us, so what is it? It's our party that's put forward the bill. It's not about stopping people from smacking their children, it's about stopping people from getting away with beating children with weapons. Okay, well if I was your child and I did something really mean, like squirt you in the face with a water gun while you were sleeping, how would you discipline me? <laughs> <laughs> I think it depends very much how old you are. I think a very young child, you discipline differently from someone who ought to know better. <laughs> I, I'd uh, just say, look, it's not a good idea to wake me up like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I would shout, and then, and then I would get her back later when she wasn't noticing. <laughs> we are controlling transmission. Don't touch, don't touch that, don't touch that dial.